Hey there Space Cowboys, welcome to episode 47 of Zorzo Plays Elite on the BBC Master 128. I hope you're doing alright, I'm feeling alright. Uh, I could do with another coffee but I think we'll be okay. Alright, I've picked out Tezar Ed Ed because it is a rich industrial with a tech level 15, doesn't get much better than that. It's corporate state so it's gonna have, there'll be some action but not too much. We're sat at average agricultural and we're taking to industrial, so that means we need to buy some. Oh, look at those furs. 50, that's brilliant. We'll take those. So 21 tons of furs and we'll grab another 9 tons of liquor and wines. So we'll have 9 of those, please. And where are you? And all of those, they're a bargain. That platinum, oh, that platinum's a little bit cheap as well. I'll grab that as well. We've got the cash. Right then, got everything set. Oh yeah, we're at 642 kills there. So that's nice. That's really nice. So okay then, let's get ourselves underway to. Oh, uh, no, no, that's a... W oh, dear. Okay, no, we're in which space now? Wow. Oh, we are in trouble. We are in trouble deep. Oh, we are in so much trouble. Get moving. Let's get away from these guys. We have got very little in the way of shields at the moment. Oh, there he is. Look at the frame rate here. Brilliant. Oh. I'm noticing no bounty. No bounty. And the controls are twitchy as all hells. Wow. Whoa. There is an alien item pretty much on top of us there. Wow, check this frame rate out. Can we pick this up? Have we got room for that? I think I left a bit of room. There we go, whoa. Alright, where was it we were going? Here, yeah. heart is in my mouth. Look how quickly the shields are recharging though. Compass is freaking out, okay. Whoa! Okay. Wow. Okay, I'm not sure they count or whether... We didn't get any bounty for those, that's a shame. That's a crying shame. So that's what happens when you just get a spontaneous accidental witch space jump. That asteroid was no match for us. Let's just check the prices. Oh, oh yeah, we are. Um, oh yeah, look, <laughs> I'm making a killing here. Right then, I'm not sure if we should just hurry on to the station and then we can galactic hyperdrive, hopefully. Easily found the space station, that's brilliant. Oh no, I went and cursed it, didn't I? I went and cursed it. There it is. Don't do that to me. Don't do that to me, please. Okay. I think we're probably going to do a little bit of time dilation now. So, um, I'll see you in, I'll see you inside the space station then.
Okay, so we're back. Look, we've got crosshairs on the right and left hand side now. With our newly installed beam lasers. We never did get to fire those, did we? We never installed those on the um, on the front of the ship. We would jump straight from the pulse to the military, because Commander Zorzo is badass like that. All right, let's just. That's not quite lined up. I hate these dodecahedral space stations. Very tricky to see if you're lined up properly, and I don't like the slightly chunkier docking port. Who are misses? Uh, why are you uh, can you not see I'm trying to park oh we better move slide under them like that there we go easy does it there we go beautiful we're in alright let's quickly sell that 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 might as well sell that too brilliant fuel right then I think it's a let's buy that excellent and I think we'll also splurge I, I'm gonna get the so I'm gonna buy the escape pod which is gonna change the color of the hood at the bottom there um, so number eight, so it should go white now, I believe. There we go. Ooh, changes. And I'm gonna buy the energy bomb. Now we are fully souped up. That's what I'm talking about. Um, so we haven't really got. I tell you what, we've got enough time to galactic hyperspace. I think. Um, is there anything particularly cheap here that we could buy? Um, not really. Let's go. Okay, so here we go. Oh, it's nice with the white. I like that. It's easy on the eyes. So here we go, Galactic Hyperspace. This is awfully fast, if you remember. Engage. Brilliant. So where are we? Anarchy. Galaxy 3, and it's dropped us in an anarchy world. <laughs> okay. Brilliant. Welcome to Galaxy 3. They weren't really a problem for us. So we're going to have to make a name for ourselves all over again. No one's heard of Commander Zorzo here. Alright, let's try and oh, we are quite far away from that planet. Okay, we might as well have that. Radioactives. Right, let's jump let's jump onto this Ah oh, I don't uh, Will the shields hold? Is it just me or does the frame rate seem higher? It suddenly seems like the frame rate is so much quicker than it was before. Unless that's just adrenaline. Whoa. Yeah, it feels quicker. Why does it feel quicker? seen him off. Where's that cargo canister? I know this sh probably shouldn't be messing around with this kind of thing in an anarchy world, but yeah, that's a sure sign that we shouldn't be doing this. Let's get... Yeah, we got that quick enough. Python trying his luck. Okay, okay. We are, our shields are pretty much... Tell you what, we have got hyperspace fuel. What have we got here? That's a dictatorship. 
Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Oh, that was slightly too close for comfort. And we lost the fuel scoops. There's a shock. That never happens. That never happens. Does galactic hyperspacing wipe out your um, illegal status? Just take him out before he does too much damage. And slow down a bit. This frame rate is freaking me out. It seems to have just gotten so much faster and I don't is it just me? Is anyone else noticing this effect? Okay, come on shields. Come on shields, we need you back. Please don't attack. Please don't attack. Uh, he's one of those. Floating Asp Mark II just sat there doing nothing. It's 20 credits though, so it's a shame not to blow them up. Even if they don't, or may not strictly count as a kill. So that's the shields at half. Go away. Treasure. Oh, <laughs> every time with that. Why are none of you telling me? <laughs> Oh no, we sh really should have let the shields recharge those up. Let's take these fools as quickly as... Oh no, no! That's the energy bomb. What have we jumped into here? It's, it's, not, it's, only, a, it's only a dictatorship. Shouldn't be this bad, should it? I mean, we weren't getting this action in that feudal world. Is this a little asteroid or a big one? That's a little one. It being a big one, I was contemplating mining it for a change. Oh no, that's not good. Right. I don't know what is going on today. Galaxy 3 is a dangerous place to be. Is that an adder? That better not be an adder. It is. Ah, scumbag. Yeah, don't try and pick that up. So, so we've got no fuel scoops. <laughs> Speed up a bit. Well, we jumped out of the frying pan straight into the fire. We're at Z Z's anus. <laughs> Let's try to say that. Um, the locals are telling me it's pronounced Zianus. Okay. Zianus. If you say so. There we go. Get rid of him. Right. Are we mass locked here or can we? No. Right. Let's pull. Let's do the pulling up over the planet trick. Let's see if that gets us any joy. At least the shields are back now. Uh, 
I'm not really sure. Is this running at a higher frame rate? It certainly feels like it when we were making those attack runs on the pirates. Or is it just Galaxy 3? Does it get harder as the galaxies go up? Is that what it is? Should we have stayed in Galaxy 2? If that's true, then what's Galaxy 8 like? Like you, you hyperspace to a, a corporate state and 15 ships drop out of hyperspace and attack you and you die within seconds. No joy with this space stations at the moment. Let's have a look at the status. Maybe it'll have just bumped us up to clean. I mean to elite. We're clean though. I think we did I say that galactic hyperspace does that wipe out illegal status? That would be very nice, wouldn't it? Bit of an extreme measure. So we got some stuff in the cargo hold before we lost the fuel scoops again. Ah, oh, what? Yeah, you're saying it's up there. Okay. Do I just need to wait a little bit longer? With the S thing. I'm not ashamed to admit that that I was I was slightly worried at points during this episode. It's two points where things got slightly troublesome. Large green slimy lizards. I'm not sure I'll be going down to the planet to take a look at those. I believe that wasn't there some policy in the manual for for BBC Elite, for Classic Elite, that says um, there's, there's certain rules about visiting the surface. I must admit, one of uh, one of the things I always wanted was to be able to fly down to the surface, um, but I have to admit it's a bit of a pointless pointless addition. The space stations make far more sense in terms of um, gameplay and, you know, what's the point in going down to the planet? You'd just be doing, you know, trading and etc, etc that you do at the space station. But with a lot more faffing around, I suppose. It was one of the things about um, Elite 2. I suppose Elite 3 as well. Never really got the point of the... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I mean, honestly, can you not see him coming in? I'll just fly straight through you. I don't care. It doesn't, no skin off my nose. So there we go. Fuel, and let's get those fuel scoops again. Honestly, how many times have we bought those? We're going for some kind of a record. But I'm going to have to end the episode there. It's gone a little bit longer than I, um, than I anticipated with all that messing around. But we're in Galaxy 3. Welcome to Galaxy 3. So um, I don't know what there is here. I don't ever remember being here in the BBC version. But I suppose there is um, not much to do. Oh, my. God, I wish I'd bought those computers now. I wish they had some narcotics to sell, but anyway. Right then, thanks very much for watching, as ever. Um, I'm Commander Zorzo, I hope you enjoyed that. If you if you did, please click that like button, that really helps me out. Um, if you're not subscribed, click that subscribe button if you want to uh, me informed of more of this craziness nonsense in outer space um oh uh, no point selling those here is there well that's the end of that i almost almost forgot to say i was considering recording an episode all 
in character as Commander Zozo, but I tried it the other day, and it's, I, I don't know, for me it's a bit weird watching it back, um, but I don't know if you'd find that entertaining or not, um, but basically I'm just in character as Commander Zozo all the way through the episode, yeah, like I say, I tried it out the other day, and I wasn't sure, um, but if, um, if people want to see that, then let me know, and I'll do that for you. Um, I must admit, it's a little bit of fun for me, but like I say, also slightly weird for me to watch back. Anyway, until next time, I'll see you. You take it easy out there, guys. Um, bye.